I'm a Frost fan, so I'm gonna welcome back to the video. And guys, and guys, what, and guys, and guys, and guys, what we're gonna be doing in this video is I'm gonna be showing you guys how you guys get the Inferno, uh, J Cargo, and Roman Reigns event cards for free. All right, I'm a Frost fan. If you guys enjoyed the video, hit hit the hit the, hit the like button below, hit the subscribe button if you have new channel, hit the little bell, like guys know whenever I post a video. And guys, uh, if you guys like to follow me on Supercard, come on baby, come on, 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 come on baby, come on. All right, I'm a Frost fans. If you guys like to follow me on Supercard, just type, just type in a paint, paint Frost, paint, paint and Frost, lowercase. But remember, if there, if there's a space after my name, you guys won't be able to find me. But, but, but if you type, but, but if you type, but if you type my name, all, all one, all one, all one word without a space, then, then, then you got, then, then you guys find me on Supercard, and, and you can type, and you can type my name, a, a, a lowercase or all uppercase. Either way works. And guys, um, if, if you got, if, if you guys like to get a. Uh, a, a, a quick shot, a quick shot on my YouTube channel. Just, 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 just write me, just write, just write me in Supercard, or you guys write me in YouTube. But remember, or remember in your YouTube, YouTube, YouTube comment. Just, 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 just write, just, just write Supercard names. Be a lot easier to find you guys. All right, guys, let's do a quick shot to uh, Column. We got, but guys, but guys, but guys, go check him out on Supercard. He's a, he's a fan. He's, he's a fantastic guy. He's an all awesome Supercard player. He's a fantastic friend. Here's, here's, here's card. Here's, here's his cards. Right, perfect. Tend to keep, keep the fantastic work. Keep being awesome. Here's team as well. If you guys have to go check it out. All right, I'm a Frost fans. Here we go, guys. Are you guys ready? I'm gonna be showing you guys how you guys guys should get both of the brand of the brand of the brand of the of the brand new J Cargill and Roman Reigns Inferno event cards for free. There's actually there's actually a few ways to do it, especially for the Roman. The J Cargill might be a little bit you know might be a little bit tricky, but but there is a way to do it though. I will show you guys that. Are you guys ready? So, but there is a way to do it, and I will show you guys. It's actually really really helpful it's actually really cool okay but uh, but as a but but as you but 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 as you but but as you guys know with the actual j cargo and roman range you guys can actually get it in the actual bonus chance packs as uh as you guys know of course you guys can get in, like the bonus chance pack you, you guys have like rules of the ring i believe this is actually the 750 credit pack but but as i said you guys can actually get the j cargo and the roman reigns but there's actually a quick way of actually getting the Roman Reign pretty easy, of course. Now, the J Cargo might be a little bit, you know, tricky, but there is still a way to getting it. But as I said, though, you guys have the bonus chance packs, which is cool. And they could still potentially have, like, some game modes and stuff. If you guys noticed, did you notice there ain't no Xavier Woods uh, Xavier Woods uh, bundle? Yep, that bundle only lasts, I think, like, three days or something like that. Yeah. Yep. Yep. But as I said, though, yeah. So yeah, so that is how you guys get a lot of the that is how you guys get the Roman Reigns and the J Cargo in the store. But they could also have like more like um, game modes and stuff like that where you guys get more of them. So pretty much, okay. But now, but now though, guys, I'm gonna show you guys how you guys can actually get more tokens to get the cards in the game mode and stuff. But yeah, let me show you guys. But as I said, if you guys want to get if you guys want to get more like sword tokens like here and more crown coins like this. So yeah, but I said you guys have the store as you guys know. Then you guys have Dungeon Smasher. If you guys do the dungeon smash, you guys get you, then you guys get sword tokens and stuff, and then you guys can use the sword tokens to actually turn them into crown coins. But but remember, but remember though, guys, you guys can actually get sword tokens in the free packs that you can actually get a bonus chance up to like twenty, which is cool. And then and then and then and then and then of course then you guys have like cute 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 free bundles and quests that type of stuff. And then and then and then you have and then, and then you have on their website www.supercar.com. You actually you actually get three sword tokens. For free every single day it looks like they could also have some crown coins but but as i said you guys get three sword tokens but technically three crown coins as well every single day because if you win the throne hunter or well, if you win the tournament you can turn those sword tokens into crown coins you know what i mean yep so that's actually really cool though but as i said though the other way of actually getting you know sword tokens besides that is actually going to be the big one but as I said, guys, the tag team takedown has about six days left. Just to let you guys know, whenever it completes, we're probably not going to get any other game modes to get the sword token. So if you guys want to get everything completed, including the big card like the Rome, like the like the J Car Guild, the Roman Reigns, and also the Cody Rhodes, yeah, it's gonna you're gonna get a whole lot, yeah. But as I said though, um, yeah. But as I said, if you guys win, you guys get a you guys get two sword tokens. Now if you get max wins, you guys can you guys get up to ten because you guys get five packs in total. Yep. But as I said. Yep, if you guys win, you guys get up to 10, and you also have a bonus chance at the crown coins. But no matter what, even if you guys get 10 sword tokens, if you win the tournament matches, and technically you get 10 crown coins, but you can also get the bonus 5. So technically, you get 15 crown coins. So you get 10 sword tokens and 15 crown coins for, you know, what's still, you know what I mean? Yeah. 
So that's actually what's really cool though. But also the other way of actually getting a whole lot of like sword tokens to turn them into crown coins is pretty much going to be in the drop board. And the best way to get a whole lot of super coins is that is actually is that, is that, is actually is that, is that, is actually going to be in the uh, money 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 the bank TVG team summer ground PVP campaign and bundles, which is really cool. If you guys do that, then you guys can actually. Then you guys can just do this, do the draft X times 25. You can do this three times, like always, which is pretty much just normal. But, of course, maybe a lot of people don't know how to do that. So just showing you just in case. And then, as you guys know, whenever you guys are on the draft board, you guys get the sword tokens. You can't, you can't get crown coins on the draft board, but you get sword tokens. But if you play the tournament matches, then you get a crown coin. So technically, either way, you still do get a crown coin, but in, but in a different way. You know what I mean? It's actually cool that they have it like this because – it makes it a lot easier, you know? I know because if you want to get one thing, you know, like a some, if you want to get like a specific thing, like say you want to get a sword token pretty much all the time, and you just get a whole lot of crown coins, yeah, it might make it a little bit tricky. But the thing is, what's actually cool about it, you get the sword tokens, but then if you win the match, you can get the, you get to turn the sword tokens into a crown coin. That's what's cool about it. But the thing is, you can't turn a crown coin into a sword token, so... That's kind of, you can't really do that. That's kind of off the table for that, so yeah. But now, there is actually an easy way of actually getting. Now, the reason why I'm showing you guys that is to get for the game modes and stuff. But now, if you guys go to the quest, if you guys see all this, right? You guys see this right here? You guys get 20 sword tokens. You also get 20 crown coins if you complete the quest or the challenge. And you also get a pygmy pack, which is the, uh, the bonus chance pack. And you get a bonus chance of Jay Cargill and Roman Reigns. So it's a 7% chance. Same thing in the store. And you also get a guaranteed Roman Reigns in the quest. So if you guys complete it, you guys get a guaranteed Roman, which is really cool. Now this word starts to come into play even more. Now, as I said, though, if you guys are actually turning all of your tokens, your sword tokens, into uh, into uh, crown coins, remember, you have to win the matches. But if you're trying to get the some of the cards, what I would recommend is actually trying to get SummerSlam cards. Get these cards first to actually help you, and then whenever you do that, then you can start to get the Inferno cards. This is a really good game, but not to mention every single time you guys get one of the big cards, you know, even like a SummerSlam, you get tons of XP. It's uh, it's actually pretty broken. I'll explain to you guys. This will be the next video, the next one. So yeah, but as I said, here's the store for it, and you can also buy the. I'll, I'll explain that, but yeah, you guys can buy sword tokens there, which is cool. Yep. So whenever you guys do that, then you guys can head over to Throne Hunter, and then whenever you guys do that, whenever you guys play all your matches for your uh, tournament, then you turn them into crown coins. Then, if you guys do the sharp multiplier, have all six of these pro. These are the easiest. All you have to do is upgrade them. But if you're if you're at SummerSlam, if you're trying to get to you know, as I said you can do whatever you. Want. It's up to you guys what you want to do, of course. So yeah, you can actually just upgrade everything and just pro them and get the sharp multiplier times twenty four because you want to get the maxed out so you get more shards. Because the reason why, if you guys go to the puzzle shards, you guys see this. If you at the for at a number a number a number one a number a number a number a number, a number one for the puzzle shard, you actually get a guaranteed Roman Reigns, and I believe a few puzzle pieces later, a couple of them, you get a guaranteed Jay Cargill, which is cool. Then after that, you're pretty much looking for the three Cody Rhodes cards. Yep, you guys get one, two, and you guys get three on the last one. So in total, you guys get five, I believe. So that's cool. But guys, that is how you guys can do it, but there's actually a little trick to doing this. So you want to get the puzzle rewards. The first one's easy, and then also getting the J-Car going too shabby. But the thing is, if you guys want to get the dices, uh, here's the, here's the, here's the, here's the cheat, here's, here's the, here's the, here's the, here's the, here's the, here's the, here's the cheat sheet that I use. Let me actually show you guys in full screen. This is the cheat sheet for one to eight different possibilities. And if you guys, if you guys actually do the pattern right, you can definitely guess of what the next pattern is going to be. It's actually going to be really cool, though. If you guys actually want to know more about it, go check out my one video that I posted yesterday. I also have, like, I have a couple different dice roll videos. If you guys want to go check them out, I explain more about it. It's actually really cool. But as I said, though, here's how you guys can actually do more for it for the dice rolls. The dining, you don't want to do the one for one dice. That is, like, the worst one because you only get one chance, but not to mention uh, you don't get any bonus extra shards just in case. Just in case if you don't get the... Even it said even if you don't get all of the bonus shards, you know what I mean? So yeah. You want to at least get like compensated for it. Now for the double one, you get at least five, so technically you get about a half, which is about 120, if you get a shard multiplier of 24. And the same thing goes for the dungeon. Now for the throne room, you get a you get a base puzzle shard of 10. 
which is over 240, which is the max. And you also get three dice rolls, and that's where this cheat sheet comes into play. But also, you can also use the cheat sheet for the two dice as well. You can even use it for the one as well if you want it. Yeah. And you guys see how many puzzle shards you need. I need over 2,250 to get the first Cody Rhodes, and a little bit more after that, probably about like 2,500 and then 2,700. So it's probably going to be about 2,250 and then about 25 and then probably about like 2,700 to about like 3,000 shards. So, yeah. But, guys, though, that is how you guys get the brand new Roman Reigns. It might seem a little bit interesting, but as I said, if you guys want to get the Roman, remember, you get it at the you get it at the, you get get it it the the first puzzle shard. That one's actually the easiest because I think you'll need like 100 shards or something like that. If you do that tactic right away with this and get a whole bunch, and I actually showed you guys how to get the sword tokens and crown coins. If you play the game right, you can definitely get all this done pretty quick. And if you guys do the quest, you guys get a guaranteed Roman Reigns here, I believe. And so that's actually two right there. That's a guaranteed pro. And then, of course, if you play a little bit more for the puzzle shards, then you guys get a Jay Cargill. And then on this, I don't know when you get it because I don't remember. But, yeah, it's probably it's probably somewhere here. Um, and then after that, then on the last three, you get the three Cody Rhodes, which is pretty cool, right? Now, that's what I call awesome. But, guys, though, if you guys have any other questions, let me know in the comments, and I will answer your questions. But, yeah, let me know, guys. All right, I'm a Frost Eye. All right, I'm a, I'm a Frost Knight. I'm a Frost fans. I hope, I hope, hope guys, I hope, hope you guys have enjoyed the video. If you guys have, uh, hit, hit the, 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 hit the like button below. Hit the, hit the, hit the, hit the subscribe button if you got a new channel. Hit the little bell. Hit like guys know whenever I post a video. And guys, and guys, and guys, and guys, always thank you, thank you, guys, thank you, thank you guys so much for all the support. It means a lot to me. And I hope, and and I hope, and hope, and hope, and I hope everyone's having a fantastic day. Everyone's doing good. But guys, but guys, but guys, but guys, but guys, always thank you, thank you guys, thank you, thank you guys so much for all the support. It means a lot. And as always, guys, I'll see you next one. Peace out. Love you.